Good morning. Welcome to another day of Vlogmas. Today I am going at it slow. It is a slow Sunday morning. I spent it editing two videos, um, one for tomorrow and one for another day. I ended up decluttering our bathroom vanity and I was going to include it in yesterday's vlog, but it ended up being a really good video to do um, on its own. So it ended up being a little too long to be part of the vlog. So I decided that it would be its own separate video for some decluttering and organizing motivation for you all. And I'm so happy that I did it. Um, if that video is up before this one, I'll link it. If not, um, it will be in the Vlogmas playlist because it will be put up during Vlogmas. So it is Sunday. Maddie has Acro Dance. Her original Acro class ended last week, but she's doing an Acro group dance and that starts today. It is actually 15 minutes longer than her Acro class both the same time. And then we're also gonna pick up a few things from the Buy Nothing group. I was the lucky recipient of some cups. I'm trying to replace some of our kids' plastic dishes with glass. So I got three Disney villain ones. They're really cute. So I'm excited to pick those up as well as I'm trying to collect the yearly ornaments from Michael's and somebody has a 2014 one for me. So I'm going to pick those up before Acro. Then I'm hoping to make a grocery list before we go as well. So I can stop by the grocery store and do something productive when she is at Acro. And then we're going to come home and probably clean a little bit. I want to move her desk out of her bedroom into the playroom. I also want to, well, I need to clean the kitchen before we go. And the dishes are all over the place. Matt ran into work. So I want to do that. And I have another load of laundry that I got to put in the wash, one to put in the dryer and one to fold. So it never ends, does it? Anyway, thanks for being here. And thanks for joining me during Vlogmas. And I'm going to get some cleaning and, um, head out to Acro. It is already 12 o'clock, so lunch will have to happen too, somewhere in there. So we have an hour to get some of these household chores done. And here's an overview of what the kitchen is looking like right now. Church bells sing 
we're home now. It is four o'clock. Actually, it's 20 after and I am going to straighten up the playroom. We put out our snowman outside and kind of did part decorating. It's just, it's so cold out today and I know it's going to get colder, but I do think that the temperature is supposed to warm up during the week. So probably on Tuesday after school, we'll finish doing a little bit of decorating, but it does get, it is hard when you work all day and then decorating. So I don't know, it might wait until the end of the week, into the weekend, but I have all these um, Christmas decorations up here or Disney decorations and we didn't get around to decorating the playroom right yet so I thought I would go through those and decorate with the things I'm going to decorate with and then the other things decide what I want to do with them so they've kind of been living in this corner here and the playroom is I mean it's not too too bad we don't have a ton of things we have a vacuum in the middle of the room and that's our lego set but i think what we're going to do is move maddie's desk in here and put it where the lego table is and then kind of have that area for her crafting and then when i'm in my office which is right in there in the dark when i'm in there she can be at her desk and we can be near each other she likes that and then we still have the massive dollhouse so it is pretty decluttered, but I do have things that need to be put away. So I'm going to go through these decorations and use what I need to use. Or maybe first I'll move the desk. I think I'll do that first. <laughs> We're still up in the playroom. We moved Maddie's desk into the room and it looks great. We also made a few changes. Realistically, I'm not getting the basement decorated this year as much as I want to. It's just not happening. Maybe next year it will, but I moved the tree that we had. I was the tree that was in the kitchen last year that I was gonna use in the basement. I brought that up because it was just sitting in the storage room and it's such a nice tree. Um, that's back in the dining room and I moved the gingerbread tree that was in the dining room up into the playroom and I really like how it is in the corner. So this is what it's looking like right now. I left the gingerbread decorations on it because I figured they're whimsical and childlike. So we'll go with it. Um, I'll have to fix some of these guys because it is a little snug here because of the roof line, but we're gonna keep it in this corner. I think it looks the best. And I'm gonna add the black and white buffalo check ribbon that we had on it last year, as well as the red uh, velvet. And we're gonna add that to the tree and then add our Disney ornaments. Okay, so this is what the tree is looking like. I am in love with it and I think I made the right decision bringing it upstairs instead of using it in the kitchen. I thought I would like the gingerbread and candy cane theme, but I didn't want to spend a ton of money and this way, you know, and actually, honestly, there hasn't been a lot of decorations to purchase. So I added the Disney things, the red, the buffalo check and the white solid velvety ribbon alongside with the striped red that I already had the striped red ribbon that we already had and the gingerbread ribbon and we added all these little touches of Disney into the tree. Then I put the things I want to put on the wall um, here Days to Santa, letters from Santa Box, kids have two stockings for in here. Then I put Maddie's Zoom, holiday Zoom Zooms on that little uh, wooden host that we have. And I know I want to display the Nutcracker and the Pinocchio Nutcracker somewhere. 
I actually have a Mickey and Minnie a Nutcrackers downstairs that I'll probably bring up for this room as well. And Maddie has a few things for the dollhouse that she wants to put in and we'll make that I festive. Will. Then over here in the Lego stand, I have this little Mickey um, and Friends tree. On the second shelf, I put a little gingerbread house and down on the first shelf, I put our ceramic Mickey tree and the ornament that plays fireworks. So we'll get to the rest of it when we get home. Um, we have to run out again for another dance. I think this time I'm just gonna sit in the parking lot of the studio and have a tea and, are you okay? Yeah. Okay. Sit in the parking lot, the dance studio, have a tea and, and just wait for her probably like scroll through my phone or read or do something pr productive that way, but not spend any money because I don't need anything. Okay, so I'm sitting in the parking lot of the grocery store. I know I went to the grocery store earlier today, but I forgot to get celery and we need that for the chili. And this camera is not, the gimbal is all out of whack. There we go. Okay, so I know that I went to the grocery store earlier, but I need to get some celery and I'm gonna pick up the deli meat for the kids. They, Sobeys didn't have anything that my kids would like eating. And I'm also gonna pick up some uh, fresh pasta. They like to have that in their thermos for lunches. So I'm gonna do that. I got myself a, the shadowing is horrible because it's dark, but I got myself a peppermint tea and I'm gonna head down to the parking lot of the dance studio be after I get these things and just wait for Maddie in there, probably scroll my phone and look through Pinterest for some ideas and kind of finalize some of my Christmas shopping. And never brought 